Well, six months after losing a home and a business during a tornado, a family in Kearney gets a second chance. It's a chance made possible by their neighbors living up to the Oklahoma standard. Two News reporter Joe Hankey has that family story new on two. May 19th, a tornado rips through Kearney. Jeremy Knox and his family ride out the storm down the street from their home in a shelter at his parents. It was scary. We were holding on to the storm shelter door. I mean, my dad were both hanging on it because it was trying to take the door off the cellar. Everything in sight was leveled, including their home and auto repair business, but only one thing came to mind, rebuilding. There is hope. This is just a, a stepping stone to something better. Gotcha. That something better arrived today. Dozens of volunteers with Habitat for Humanity. Hammers in hand, ready to build a house. In just an afternoon, the walls are up and trusts are in place. Nice. It's kind of it's kind of strange because it's already up, you know, just day one, and it's pretty much uh, framed. A group of strangers, not one, knew the Knox family before today. When people are in need, it's always been my experience that people uh, rise to the occasion and, and always help out. Some of those here today came to Kearney immediately after the tornado to help with cleanup and are now returning to help rebuild. So it's real fun for us to be able to come back to Kearney now and to be part of the team that's helping to build a new house here. Providing support for a family without a place to live or turn to after the tornado. When something like this happens, you typically can go to mom's house to stay with them, you know, during the process, or you go to your sister's house. But unfortunately, like many others, we lost my mom's house and my sister's house. So. We we're all kind of spread out, and her dad's. Six months later, and now one day closer to returning to normal. In Kearney, Joe Henke, 2 News, it works for you. Now, Jerry Knox says his family's new house should be done by December 19th, just in time to celebrate Christmas with his wife and four boys.